gang violence continues to make the security situation in Haiti untenable, and uh, it is a, a region that demands our attention and action. Hi, I'm Cristina Caicedo-Smith, VOA Press Freedom Reporter. Here's a look at journalism in Haiti and other stories on media this week. Violence and instability in Haiti are making coverage ever more dangerous for journalists. Media watchdogs are documenting kidnaps, threats, injuries of reporters inside Haiti. And those in the diaspora are working to report the story while worrying for family is still in Haiti. Because we're not just reporting it uh, dispassionately, factually, but it's also affecting us personally. Broadly adopted, congratulations to the rapporteur. In Europe, media are offered better protection from political interference thanks to a new act adopted by the European Parliament. VOA pays tribute to a trusted fixer and friend who had a long career covering Gaza. Veteran journalist Mohamed Dawas died in Gaza late last year. He had suffered a stroke and lacked the necessary medical care as he and his family fled fighting. And after 15 years, a U.S. immigration judge grants asylum to Mexican journalist Emilio Gutierrez Soto and his son. Emilio fled Mexico for the U.S. after death threats over his investigations into Mexican military wrongdoing in Chihuahua State. For these stories and more, check out voanews.com forward slash press freedom.